hurricane season 2020 today we're going to be talking about lights different style of lights and batteries stay tuned welcome back to hurricane season 2020 this is a video series that i am doing this is video number two and today we're going to be talking about some different lights and batteries and that type of stuff okay so right now a lot of this stuff is actually still considered quote non-essential so a lot of this stuff is available in the stores and like i said in my last video and i'll keep saying until i get to the essential stuff um this way here everybody knows um what to go out and get <clears throat> because it's coming soon so we're gonna start off with flashlights um, these here, I get these at Walmart. These are LED lights. They're, they're really bright. Um, you get them, they come with the battery and you get them for $5.98. So I, I have several of these in my house. I put one in each room uh, for that price and you can't go wrong. If you're gonna buy these kind of flashlights and stuff, you wanna make sure that you buy batteries for them. Now these run you, I, th I think a two pack runs you like $6.98, I think it is. Uh, don't hold me to it, um, but make sure you have extra batteries for these if you are using these. Um, you have your good old Meg light. You can't go wrong with the Meg light. I love them. Um, they can be used for self-defense, banging on something, anything like that. They take a beating, they're waterproof. They're a great flashlight. I'd suggest, <clears throat> you can always pick up those you know, like a, a family pack, I call them. You know, you get like uh, four or five flashlights in there and you always get these little ones. And these little ones would be really great for your kids um, because, you know, if the power goes out and you're in a hurricane or something and your power's out for a couple of weeks or whatever, if they have their own little flashlight so they kind of feel important, you know, and they can see their way around, it kind of, you know, makes it fun for them in a sense. You know, it gives them a sense of uh, security. Now you have these, uh, these little lanterns, but they run on batteries. And um, I don't know, um, my mother-in-law picked these up through some magazine that she had. Um, but, um, you know, they run on uh, two AA batteries. And they, they last for quite a while. It is plastic, you know, so if you dropped it or something, it would, it, it would probably break. But, you know, if you look around out there, you know, online or something, you know, you can find some pretty inexpensive things. Um, she got a six pack of these, I think, for like 20 bucks. And they work. You know, they put off light. You know, I bought these. You get these a four pack. Um, I got them on Amazon. Um, actually, I took them camping with me last year when I went up north for two weeks. And uh, these are LED lights and they slide out and they are very bright at nighttime. And then you can push it down and you can control you know exactly how much light you want to put out um, these run on i believe three or four double a batteries and they do last a long time i like the fact that they have uh real sturdy hangers here so if you had to open this thing up and then hang it up somewhere so it lights up the whole room they work great you know <clears throat> another thing one of my big things you're hear me talk about is your headlamps. I love my headlamps. I got hooked on them last year when I went on my two week trip and I never used one before. I, you know, just thought it was ridiculous. I always just used, you know, there's a big difference between putting this on your head and being able to use both your hands and then try to handle a mag light that's very heavy and you're trying to do something then chop wood, fix something or anything else, you strap this on your head, um, you turn it on, it's very bright. As you can see, you can you can zoom it out, zoom it in, and when it's nighttime and it's dark out, you have a low beam, you have a strobe. Um, let me tell you what, it lights up the force like you would not believe. And these things are worth their weight in gold. Now, when you get to batteries, I have a battery case here, okay? I picked this battery case up, it comes with the tester to test your batteries to make sure they're still good. I picked this up on Amazon, 10, 12 bucks. They still have those in stock. Um, all my batteries I've been buying on Amazon because they've been having some really good sales on batteries. 
Um, so if you're looking to stock up on some batteries for hurricane season, I would go on there and check and see. I did buy these all roughly about a month ago and I got really good deals on them. So that's the reason I bought them, uh, just to have them because uh, once the hurricane season gets a little bit closer and everybody starts to prepare for that stuff, well, all these batteries and stuff go start going skyrocketing because everybody's going to want them. So my advice to you is get out there and buy this stuff now. Um, all this stuff is, quote, non-essential, so it is available in all the stores. Um, you can pick up all this kind of stuff. You know, you don't have to worry about it not being in stock or anything like that. And... <clears throat> It's something you want to get going on because the prices of this will go up. It does every year around hurricane season. So if you live in a hurricane prone area, you people already know that. So my name is Charles. This is Survival Preparedness for Beginners. And until next time, I'll catch you on the flip side.